Well, if it isn't our resident brainiac. Do you have any new scientific breakthroughs to share with us, Einstein? <laughs> oh, come on. Don't tell me you're actually proud of being a walking encyclopedia. I'm surprised those glasses haven't given you superpowers yet. <laughs> so tell me, nerd, where does one find such professional clothing? The clearance section of Dorks R Us? <laughs> Aww. Your mom thinks that you look smart, does she? I didn't know fashion disasters were considered smart. <laughs> I guess I have to call your mom and learn all about what's in these days. Does she have a blog I can follow? <laughs> oh my god, too funny. Bye girls! See you at the game tonight. <laughs> We're gonna get our cheer on. <laughs> Wait, hold up! Nerd! Wait! <laughs> I want to ask you something. Now that we're alone, I want to talk to you. Yes, you. Do you see any other bookworms around here? You know, for someone so smart, you're not the quickest dweeb, are you? Anyways, I need a favor. I need your help. Well, my dad says... I need a tutor. He says I have to get my grades up or I'll have to quit cheerleading. But that is crazy talk because I'm captain and you know I will walk through fire to keep my position and my uniform. No one can rock it like I can. You know Gretchen's been eyeing captain for two years waiting for me to break an ankle? But that's not going to happen. And I am not going to quit. But anyways... Someone as smart as you could be really helpful right now. Maybe, just maybe, we can work something out. Oh, come on. Do something useful with that brain of yours. Well, how about this? You help me and I'll tell all the guys on the football team that you're actually really cool. You don't think they'll believe me? Oh, honey. I have those boys in the palm of my hands. <laughs> you know the new girl, Sarah? She transferred last semester? Yeah, the popular one. Well, when she first got here, she was a total mess. She had no idea how to dress herself. Her hair was a disaster. She was destined for the grassy knoll with the rest of the losers. No offense. But I saw something in her. The BMW that her dad got her for her birthday. So I thought I should help the poor thing. And look at her now. She rolls with the best of us and fits right in too. All she needed was some good PR from a certain cheerleading captain and a bit of help in the fashion department, otherwise known as a complete makeover. <laughs> so you see, what I did for her, I could do the same for you. I could make school suck a whole lot less. You might even start having some fun. And hey... Maybe you can have a bit of impact on me, too. I'm serious, nerd. Listen. I want to change. I want to... Do better in school and be smart like you and all that. Whatever. I need your help. If someone like me wants to improve her grades, who better to learn from than the actual prodigy? <sighs> well, you know all that mean girl stuff is just an act. 
don't you? <sighs> the truth is, and don't tell anyone this, or I'll ruin you, but the truth is, I've always found you intriguing. Yeah, you're cute. Maybe I've been teasing you as an excuse to talk to you. Shut up. Okay. The truth is, you're better dressed than half the guys in the school. They all look like they rolled out of bed, still high from the night before. You actually look mature. Professional. That nerdy look has a certain charm. And I know you're going to be successful one day. All those football players that I usually date, they'll be working for you in five years. And you're going to be married to a girl like me. Nerd, I really need a favor. I want to prove to myself that I can do better. And I want you to start making me better. But the thing is, I, I don't actually have time to catch up to your level of intelligence by Friday. When our English lit paper is due. <laughs> Can you, please, maybe, possibly, write my paper for me? Just this once, I'd be ever so grateful. I'd owe you so much. You know what I can do for you at the school. <laughs> you know I can make people and... I can break people too, but I wouldn't do that to you anymore. Anyway, sorry about that. Um, <laughs> if you help me, I'll owe you big. Please, for me, I promise. I really want to change. And I will. Right after this English paper. Come on. Will you please help me? Will you help me be better? Ugh, are you gonna make me beg? Okay, I'm begging. Please. Please. Pretty please. With the cherry on top. Please. Please. Yes! Oh my god! Nerd! You're a lifesaver. <laughs> I'll make it up to you. Your existence at this school is a about to change. Come here. Let me give you a thank you peck on the cheek. I think you earned it. That was just a peck. But there's more to come, nerd. You'll get the rest after you finish my paper. <laughs> you want me to stop calling you nerd? <sighs> well, I guess. I guess that's fine. Uh, what's your name again? Hey, this is Lacey. 
I just wanted to say a big thank you for listening. Thank you so much. Um, and I wanted to say another thank you to everyone who joined my Patreon this week. Um, it's so incredibly kind of you. I just set it up a couple days ago, and the first day I posted it, <laughs> my link didn't work. And so I don't even know how you all um, you all got to it, and I, I really appreciate it. And thank you to my friend Lucky in the Discord who wrote to me and let me know. <laughs> so thank you, and sorry about that. Um, and I just want to let you all know that um, we still have that Discord rolling. We just hit 100 members, which is so fun. And everyone in there is so nice and sweet. And we all just have a blast, like, being super silly and, and getting to know each other a little bit better. Um, so feel free to join us if you want. The link is below. And also, um, my link for Twitch is below as well. I do some singing and hanging out on Twitch and we just kind of started that in the last couple weeks. So if you feel like hanging out a little bit more outside of YouTube, um, my links are below. And uh, a big thank you again for listening. I really, really, really appreciate it. You all are amazing. Love you. Bye.